We should have drowned that whelp in deep water the day he was born. Looking for Ermion. Oh, he's in there with him, pale as a beached carp. If he don't bring the brat in lane, who will? But no, he says, the gods gave us a king. We must support him. Support what? Svanrig is standing there like a mute fencing dummy, gazing on as that hag sells us to the black ones. Berna Bran arranged everything behind our backs. Why, well, she's not even denying it. Ah, I refuse to look upon this disgrace. Who is this? No one important? As I was saying, we shall discuss the details later. His Majesty accepts the document in its current form. Never thought I'd live to see the day. We are prepared to seal the treaty. How much would I need to pay you to take off her head, here and now? Do it for free, gladly. <sighs> the King pledges to fulfill all the conditions by the summer solstice. Before I sign, I wish to hear this from the King's mouth. Svanriga. Move out at once. You hear what the king said? Move! In Skellige, anyone can be king. All they need is the Jarls on their side. Sometimes a mediocrity gets just that, and the Isles get a ruler the clans don't respect. No one expected much of Svanriga, of Clan Twersech, but he went down in history as the founder of a dynasty and as the king who united all the clans against Nilfgaard. Svanriga, who could have known? The Jarls have one they can believe in again. And who brought you here? Come to make sure no scandal in Skellige passes you by? <laughs> 